Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a requested video which is a rundown of the Armani Code range of perfumes for women. If you're new here then welcome to my channel, it's all about perfume. Do subscribe because I have new perfume content every week and I'd love to have you here. So let's get into Armani Code. So this is a fragrance that's been out for quite a long time. It has quite the following. And back in the day, in its first sort of five, 10 years, it was really popular. You would smell this everywhere. It's now probably less popular. I guess maybe people have got bored of it, but there has been different flankers over the years. And at the moment, there are three flankers that you can get as well as the original. So I'm gonna take you through those four. So Armani Code Eau de Parfum is essentially a honey vanilla perfume. But what they've done is they've added some lovely floral notes like jasmine, orange blossom, and then a little bit of actual like citrusy orange that comes through in the very sort of first five seconds. But in the dry down, it's like a warm honey jasmine hug. It's very feminine, it's very pretty but it's not like weak or um, the way that some pretty fragrances are. It's, it does have body, it does have lasting power, though you, I would recommend spraying it a good few times, spray it in your hair, spray it on your clothes to help it last, but it's very warm, it, I think really good in autumn, winter, cozy on a chilly day, and it's just very feminine and I would say slightly sensual. So in 2015, we got Armani Code Satin. This is a more gourmand, slightly warmer, sweeter version of the original. So the vanilla is really the star of the show here, but they've added in praline and cocoa so that you get a sort of chocolatey vanilla, warm vanilla, um, making it much sweeter than the original, but it's not sugar sweet, it's chocolate sweet. The neuroli and jasmine play less of a role. And they've also put some like sorbet notes in there like a fresh sorbet and there's also a hint of ginger as well that you perhaps get in the first few seconds and a slight sharpness from the ginger in the dry down but this is definitely the most sort of sexy of the range I guess it's called satin you know it's got that sensuality to it with the sweetness you know this is a good one for evenings um yeah definitely much more sexy than the original so Armani Code Turquoise goes the complete other way so the vanilla is almost not you can't tell it's there and instead it's all about that jasmine and those white floral notes and the floral notes are neroli and orange blossom and mixed with the ginger they come across really quite citrusy especially in the first minute or two there's some pear and some musk in here and overall it's almost like an aquatic-y white florally citrusy it's fresh it's spring summer it's daytime um nice to sort of wear this during the day and then the original at night or the satin at night or have this for when it's really hot day um, and you don't want to wear the original you want to wear a fresh turquoise version and then lastly we have armani code cashmere this is a sort of sensual deep version They've added almond and heliotrope, so you get that warm, nutty vibe. Um, then you get some of the jasmine, orange blossom, but they've also put some suede and leather notes in here and a little bit of incense. So you get that warm, leatheriness. This is definitely the sort of, I guess, the heaviest of all of them. It's not sweet, it's not white floral, it's, it's leather and almond leather and almond very warm it's not so much like sexy in the way satin is but it's sensual and deep and you know if you want to take code to the next level make it more intense and this is probably the one for you so that's it let me know which ones you like if you've tried them or what you thought of any of the previous flankers that aren't available anymore and as always all these four will be mentioned down below in the comments um, where you can get them so you can check them out if you found the video useful or you liked it don't forget to give it that thumbs up and hit subscribe for more of the same but that's it let me know any more requests and i'll see you again soon bye